Hey YouTube, it's Lip Balm Queen here. Just winking here today and I wanted to do a lip balm review. So these are a few lip balms from the brand Avon. I'm super excited to be able to share these with you guys. I haven't had an Avon lip balm in my collection in many years. And um, my amazing friend Heidi, she is an Avon rep and she's fantastic. I will link her shop down below, her Avon shop. Um, she sent me these to try out and review for you guys because these are their brand new lip balms they've came out with. So I wanted to thank her for that in advance and I want to go ahead and get started and review these for you guys. So the first one she sent me is the Velmet Care Lip Balm and this is the Strawberry. This is what it looks like. And it is a tinted lip balm. That's a pretty shade. I will swatch it on my hand so you guys can see what it looks like. So it does give a nice light, um, light reddish tint. It smells so good. It smells just like their traditional strawberry lip balm. And I absolutely loved that when I was growing up. And see, it does give a nice tint to your lips. I really enjoy that. And it smells so good. God, I love that scent. If you've ever had an Avon strawberry lip balm, you'll know what I'm talking about. It's that same scent. It just smells so good. It's such a traditional strawberry. And um, it looks really good on the lips. Um, it's not overly tinted. It just looks nice. It's one of them you can wear every day. And your lips will feel moisturized as you do. I really like this one. It smells great. It looks great. And it feels great on the lips. So I'm super excited for this one. That one's really nice. Then she sent me um, the cherry lip balm. So I'm excited for this one because I had a cherry lip balm from Avon when I was younger as well. I had a bunch of those. And this is what that one looks like. About the same. A little bit lighter than the strawberry, I would say. And it smells really nice. It has a um, sweet cherry scent. Let me wipe the strawberry off and I will try the cherry on. Okay. Go ahead and apply this. See, I really love that. I love the um that it just gives you a nice subtle tint that's not overpowering. And it feels amazing on the lips. It feels um really moisturizing. And it's a thin consistency, so it doesn't feel super thick on the lips or waxy. So I really enjoy this. So cherry and strawberry are fantastic. Then she sent me a Skin So Soft, um, what is this one called? Tropical Coconut. And I love the packaging on this. I just think it's really nice. Hopefully it focuses and you can see it. I just really like the packaging on it with a little coconut on it. Um, so this one is a white balm. It's not tinted. Let me wipe my hand off here with the swatches. Okay. Mm. And this one's a nice subtle scent. It's not super strong or overpowering. It's like it has a... Um, it mainly smells like you get like a light hint of coconut, but it mainly has almost like an argon oil scent to it. It smells really good. And it's really light. It's not overpowering in any way. Let me wipe this one off. Yeah, I like this one. It just gives like a light, subtle shine to your lips. Very light. Um, obviously, it's clear. And like I said, to me, it almost has like maybe a light hint of like a coconut scent. Not sweet and strong like most coconuts. Um... But it's like a light scent and it almost smells like argon oil. If you've ever had anything that has argon oil, it's like a light scent. And it smells really nice. I enjoy that. It makes my lips feel super soft and smooth. So I'm very, very happy for that. That's a good one to wear at nighttime if you don't want anything colored on your lips or something that's maybe not um, really strongly scented or flavored. You could definitely just put that on your lips at night and that would moisturize your lips. So that's fantastic. Then she sent me the Skin So Soft Original Lip Balm, and this one is in grape. And guys, 
This has become one of my favorites. I absolutely love this lip balm. I use this one a lot in the morning time and sometimes at night. Um, this one smells fantastic. It is a clear balm. And it has a really nice grape scent. And it's not one of them artificial, overpowering, crazy grape scents. It's just a nice, subtle grape scent. And it smells so good. Um, this one has become my favorite out of every one I've tried. I absolutely love this one. This is the one that I keep gravitating towards. That I keep beside my bed on my nightstand. And I use all the time. So, I really love the grape one. It really leaves your lips feeling super soft and hydrated. And I really love this one. So, if you're looking for... Um, a new lip balm to try. I would definitely pick this one up. This one's really great. God, I just love it. It smells so good. And then the last one she sent me, which is another one of my favorites. I have become a huge fan of this one. This one here is the, um, let's see. Is it the Velmet um, Hemp Seed Oil Ultra Nourishing Lip Balm? I love the packaging on it. I love the color on it. I think those colors go good together, the black and the green. Um, and this one has such a unique scent. It's, it's hard to narrow down what the scent is. It almost smells like a grape scent as well, but but different. It's like it smells similar to this, but a little bit different. Like there's something else in it. God, it smells so good. I don't know if it's the hemp seed oil in it or what. It smells so good. Um, this is a fantastic one. Like I said, these two here have become my absolute favorite. I use these all the time now. I love these. Let me turn it where you can see it. I just love these. So out of all the ones she sent me, these two have become my favorite. The Senso Soft Original. That's um, grape scented. And you also have the hemp seed oil. So I love these. These two are my favorite ones. I love them all, but those two have become my favorite. I use them quite a bit. So I'm super excited for them. I wanted to thank Heidi for sending me these to review for you guys because I thought that was so sweet of her. So definitely check out her um, her Avon shop. I will link it in the description box down below for you guys. And I will link her Instagram in the description box down below so you guys can follow her there. That way if you have any questions about anything, you can message her on there. So, I want to thank Heidi for this, for sending me these to review, and I hope you guys enjoyed the review, and I will see you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.